Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Death May Die. Today we got Houdini and Steve to, to solve Dance Macabre. <laughs> it's just Steve. <laughs> Worst part is some of these things are real dank slimy. <laughs> this guy's Hank Samson pilled for sure. I, I love the disparity in designs to this. Like you could be Rasputin or like Einstein or Houdini. Yeah. My brain's the key that sets me free. Or Steve. He's a football player with a knife. Yeah. You know what I actually want to do? I want to make custom Steve in Arkham. I think his ability would be fun to translate. And do you know his ability? No. I'm excited to read it to you okay. when the time comes. So, uh, we have to disrupt the ritual, get all four sorcerers face up on the waterfront space. Okay. When the Elder One advances, turn any face down sorcerers in space with face down ball goers. Shuffle all face down ball goer tokens in each of those spaces. When an effect kills a face down ball goer, turn it face up. If it is dancer, discard it. If it is sorcerer, keep it face up. After the ritual is disrupted, remove all ball goer tokens from the board. Ignore any effects that would affect those tokens from now on. We can interrogate as an action. Turn out over up to two face down ball goer tokens in your space. Keep any sorcerers face up and turn the others back down. And we can also usher a ball goer. Move one ball goer token, including sorcerers, in your space up to two spaces away. Okay. So we just got to usher them to the waterfront. No problem. So I am so. Thank you for giving me this, by the way. Yeah. I got your hallucinations. Uh, you can have a different one if you want. Sure. Just some varieties yeah. and spice of life. I am a traveling fugue. I must move to a space that is two spaces away from your current space if possible. Enemies follow. My ability is tackle. Once per turn after I run, I may push one enemy in your space one or two spaces away. But then also, in my first level, when I push an enemy, I deal three wounds to it. Sick. <laughs> uh, I got compulsive accumulating. And it's enemy. I can push Azathoth. <laughs> <laughs> that fucker's host. He is. Uh, so when I reach the madness space, I put a wound token on the card before resolving it. And if I have less items and companions than the number of tokens on this card, I take stress equal to difference. Otherwise, I heal all my stress. Okay. And then I have a skate artist has a special action in a space with zero or one enemy. I can swap a figure one to three spaces away. Each one is placed directly on the other space. Ethereal slip. Yeah. And then after you... Uh, if I level it up, the first one, I get to do two damage. The oh, that's figure. cool. It's also a figure, so I can swap as with off. Let's go! I think. You can swap me, too. Yeah. I also have swiftness, which allows me to run more in toughness, take less wounds. I can swap stuff. you and take dam do damage to you. Let's go! Whoa. I want to die! <laughs> what, what are your other ones? You have Arcane, Arcane Mastery. Mastery and stuff. Nice. All right. I'll go first, because I'm Steve. I'm leading this, this yeah. show. You are the, the mastermind. All right. I'm going <laughs> to... Uh, I'm going to move. With your three concussions. Yeah, we're going to go here. I'm going to push this guy into this location. No, I think I want to fight him and kill him. Just stab him. Yeah, we'll stab him. I need two successes. I got one success. We'll roll again. Let's go again. All right, he'll take one damage. And then we're just going to attack him again. Sweet. I'll take two stress. Two, sorry, two sanity, and this guy will die. Nice. Kill I will then. draw my mythos token. Nuclear chaos. Each cultist moves one space towards you. <laughs> uh, place a cosmos token on the nearest gate. Um, one, two, one, two, three. So this one. Uh, when a cultist or monster summon the gate with any cosmic token, place one of those tokens on the summon enemy. We get a cultist up here. This guy's gonna attack me. That's not cash money of you. He'll do me one damage. Okay. And that's me. Okay. What is a special action? Uh, these ones. Okay. So basically, an episode action. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, then I'm going to spend my first action to use my escape artist. And I will... Wow! Houdini! It was, it was me you the entire whole... time! Why did you punch me? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> don't, don't, don't think too hard yeah, about that. Yeah. I'll interrogate some of these guys. Nice. Alright, so... Turn over. Keep any sorcerers face up and turn the dancers back down. But we do not need to shuffle right now. No. So we can just, like... Move these guys over sure, here. Sure, that seems stupid, but okay. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm just gonna talk to the other guys. Heck yeah. I get the other guys. Hello, you're, everyone's right. here's clean. Everyone's here's clean. 
Mythos yeah. card. Here you go. Mythos. Deep one. The nearest guy moves oh, two what to the me fuck? and kills a face down ball goer in my space. I pick one. No, I want this one. Sorry, I. I get the pick, and this guy spawns the red portal. So he gets this on him. Uh, and then this guy bonks me. Yeah, he's gonna attack you. Piece of shit. Green and a black. Two hits and a sanity. Wow. These guys ain't fucking around. Can I spend yeah, you can this? for this. Yeah, yeah, you can. I would do the 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 black one. Is it less likely roll? That will that one has no sanity on it. So that like the green dice is softer. Okay. Yeah, I'll just take one, that's fine. Oh yeah. We can live with one. But I, I want to loot awesome treasures. Names. Yeah, I also... I need to. All right. I have to, Justin. You don't understand. <laughs> uh, I'm going to move. I'm going to take this guy with me. And then I'm going to kick him in there. Okay. Because I have that power of tackle. <laughs> Great. Actually, you know what I'm going to... No, I... Oh, sorry. If it deals any wounds, we summon a deep one here. That's how these guys work. Yeah. Maybe she gets to kill on some deep ones. I am going to attack one of these deep ones. Three successes? Yeah, fucking right. James Pinkies? No, I did. Mm -hmm. Those ones aren't finished, though. That's pretty good. The ghouls are, uh... Those ones are actually coded. That's why their bases are still fucking ass. I like the the red on the, the gills sort of thing. Thank you. It's a nice touch. You guys can't see that because the camera's <gasps> on that first I section. actually fucking oh did God. kill one of them. That's huge. That's huge. And then I do get two sanity. That's also huge. I must move to a space that is two spaces away from your current thing, if possible. Fuck. Fuck, <laughs> indeed. Um, okay. Uh, we're gonna go one, two. I'm gonna kick him into here, and this guy's gonna come with me. Okay. Oh, no, sorry. I have to do that on a run. That's not running. Okay, let me just look at this again. Don't want to move up to the waterfront. Can you go up the stairs? I think I can go up the stairs, but that seems bad because then I'm with three guys. Yeah, I think I am going to just do this. Yeah. You need to level some up. I do, and I think I'm going to do the tackle. The thing that your guy does? Yeah, yes. check so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'm going to move. Hell yeah. And we're going to go one, two, and I'm going to push this guy against the wall, and then he's going to take three damage and die. And then I'm going to attack this cultist. I'm using this skill, you may swap with any figure on the board. No range. Any figure? Holy shit. I could shit. be like, you're down here, yeah. buddy. <laughs> <laughs> um, he's dead. Hell yeah. Dude, that's right. nuts. Mythos card. Yeah, they do scale up, like, really yeah. well. Each investigator takes one stress for each animal token they have. Animal companion they have. Okay. <laughs> animal token? Uh, animal. And, we, and then each investigator also loses one sanity for each ensorcelled condition they have. Okay. And then I draw one of these. Waitress! There's a bunch of secret tunnels here. She says, holding a metal serving table. We can take one stress to take the waitress. You may move between spaces with gates as if they were adjacent. It's kind of sick. Or gain it's one free reroll when attacked. Give me the waitress. I'm going to show you why they call me Steve. <laughs> that's because my name. That's my parents' name. <laughs> that's, that's, from day one, I've always been Steve. I'm going to move in here. Nice. And interrogate these nerds. Sweet. You're clean. All clean. So that means this has to be... Oh, no, there's these fuckers behind the... Oh, sorry, brother. Behind the hunting horror. Yeah. Which I don't know about you. I miss gun guy. You gonna swap? Yeah. Is that a free action? No, it's a, a special, special action. action. Okay, so that's what the, that's what a special action is then. It's just yeah. like an action that's unique to you. Yeah. Is that you? Yeah. All right, here's your Mythos card. Thank you. Hunting horror. Each time horror moves two spaces toward you, doing one to any investigator spaces there. What the fuck? <laughs> And some of hunting horror, horror yellow. I <laughs> get wrecked, Justin. He advances. There he advances. Yeah, you do that first. The cook. Companion, you'd have one free rest action each turn. That's huge. Or I could take the. I take three stress for that. Or I could take the flask to heal two stress and two wounds. I'm gonna take the cook. Yeah, seems great. All right, when he advances, move the nearest cosmic enemy one space towards you. In, in order, summon one dancer. Two, two. And one cultist, both at the farthest gate. 
Uh, place a cosmos token on the nearest non-cosmic monster. So that's got to be this guy as well. You, you hear in the in the background of the ballroom music just. <laughs> <laughs> And this guy showing up in the, the top. What, what is that? <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's a music I've never heard before. Yeah. Uh, on my level three, I can, um, I may push three enemies and deal five damage. It's such a big tackle. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> like bear hugging three of them, just slam them into the wall. So when you push an enemy, deal three wounds to it. You may push one additional enemy. You also yeah. So that deals five damage. That deals fifteen damage. Is that right? That seems wild. Yeah, it does seem. Because so when you push an enemy, deal three wounds to it. Uh -huh. You may push one additional enemy, and then you may push one additional enemy. You also deal two additional wounds. It says five total. Yeah, that's what I'm like. I'm trying to think. It's like I think it's five total to those enemies. Okay, I'll, I'll see if there's a... Oh, there might be... it says three total for the enemies, and then it says five total for the wounds. Yeah. Five to each of them seems, like, wild. That's absurd action compression. Let's see. Steve, are you part of this one? Steve? Steve? No, he's not a new investigator. Maybe he's in here. I'll check, I'll check between. Um, it's my turn? Yep. Yeah, and I haven't gone. No. Okay. We just advanced the thing. All right. I'm going to move. Huh. So these guys are unknown, these guys are unknown, these guys yeah. are unknown, and the guys up there are unknown. Uh, no, we know these ones. You did those ones. Oh, yeah, sorry. These ones and, and these ones. ones. Yeah. Uh, does moving from here to here a uh, movement? Yes. Okay. But they are, like, adjacent. Yes. Okay. All right. How do I want to do this? I want to kill somebody. Is it crazy for me to just move twice? No, because that's how I kill things. No. But I also want to check this out. Moving is like an attack. All right. You want to see my strategy? Okay. I don't know if you're going to like it. But I'm going to go one, two. And then I'm going to push this guy into here for you and deal him three damage. Okay. Because maybe you want to check out those guys. And then I'm going to go okay. one, two, three, and I'll check out these guys. Actually, I should probably heal. I'll check out those guys next turn, but I am going to heal. Okay. Three. Sure. You get Mythos? Yeah. I get uh, Cosmic Upheaval. Draw another card. It's Ancient Evils. It is. Cosmic Presence. Each Cosmic Enemy moves one space towards you. Blah, blah, blah. And this motherfucker. Okay. Go for it. You get this. Oh, I do get this. Right. Crystal Ball. Of course they were Sick. doing a seance here. I may take two stress to claim the Crystal Ball. You may take two stress to turn over up two face-down ball goer tokens in any space on the board. Oh, that oh, seems pretty good. It does. That's a rest action to... Nice. Uh, I'm going to take my free rest action. Nice. Get a bunch of stress back. And then, yeah, I'm going to... One, two, three. So sick. I'm going to push him out when I move out. Hell yeah. We're like a perfect combo. Yeah, Magic and just... Out. <gasps> it's him. Dun, 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 dun. So that means the other one's in here. So then move one ball goer up to two, sp in your sp up to two spaces away. One, two. Perfect. All right, here's your card. I have one action left because the rest is free. Whoa. Yeah. Death may die. That's what I want to do, yep. The Blind Idiot God. If Azathoth is on the board, otherwise each cosmic enemy moves one space toward you. Oh. <laughs> Some occultists in yellow. Holy shit. Okay. I oh, you haven't taken a test yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Gorilla. It's just a big gorilla. It's just, it's just a gorilla? What's the gorilla doing here? Uh, Rar. Oh. Uh, he takes three damage for me. Oh, sick. Hell yeah. Yeah, the other answer is like to become a sorcerer, and that sucks. So yeah, that doesn't, that doesn't seem great. Gorilla. 
All right. I'm going to flip these guys over. Hell yeah. <gasps> it's the guy. All right. I'm going to uh, move him to. Let's move him there. And then I'm going to run. Tackle. We're going to go one, two, and then I'm going to push and kill this guy. Hell yeah. Why attack enemy when we tackle enemy? When we run enemy. We Ooh. tackle enemy. Oh, tackle. All right, yeah, uh, you're, Mythos. You like Rita Young? I am like Rita Young. <laughs> Another cosmic upheaval. That's kind of good. Dancer of Azathoth. The nearest Dancer of Azathoth moves three spaces towards <laughs> you. <laughs> I'm not ready for the toot. <laughs> you summon a Dancer of Azathoth up here. Oh, God. All right, this guy's going to attack me. He's cosmic, so he's going to get an additional green. He dies to a tackle, though. That's as really most good. things yeah. do. Yeah, as they should. Fuck you, brother! <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! You are not ready for the two, Justin. I am not. Oh my god! <gasps> Holy shit! Anyways. He just dunked you. Uh, he's gonna move here. So we're gonna move the nearest cosmic enemy one space towards you. Done. And then we're gonna summon a dancer. Oh, and a cult is both in the farthest <laughs> gate. It's a party up here. It really is, yeah. They're That's doing the a horrible thing. That just spawned. Oh, but just, it's just the farthest monster. Okay. And these guys are the farthest monster. Yeah, okay. For me. Um, okay. Oh, are these monsters? Yeah, they are monsters because they're not cultists. Uh, but then all these get shuffled in. And it's your turn. I need to fucking heal. I'm gonna rest. And then I will move here. No, oh, I'm gonna swap places with this idiot and get fucked. Hell yeah. Uh, and then I'll punt this guy in here for my second action. Nice. And then for my third action, I'll just swap places with this asshole. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Let's go! And then give me a those. Cosmic upheaval. Wow. Oh, shit. Ancient evils. Cosmic presence. Each cosmic enemy moves one space toward you. Uh, that guy, no, 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 that no. guy, this no, guy. No. Socialite. Um, a voice said, if you want to learn about culture, spend the night drinking with it. Say, you got anything to drink on you? I can claim the sword cane, which gives me a free reroll. Sword cane? A free reroll when attacking a target in your space. If I, or if I have the flask or champagne, I may discover one to claim the socialite instead, which is unfortunate because I would like her. She gives me a level arcane mastery. So I will take the sword cane. Nice. In case I need to attack somebody. Sweet. All right, I'm going to rest. I really am out here just with basic bitch stats. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't do tests. I think I'm going to rest again. And then I'm going to run. And I'm going to just push this motherfucker into hell. She doesn't matter where he goes. Yeah. He takes three damage. All right. Move each cultist one space towards you. Fuck. Oh, shit, they're coming out of the room. <laughs> In each space that has at least one cultist will kill one face down Balgor. If it was a dancer, summon a cultist in that space. Um, I think we just kill one, though, right? Yep. Cool. Oh, I get one of these, though. Yeah, you do. Gun case. Should be able to smash it open. You may take one wound to get the handgun. Yes. <laughs> I can tackle with a handgun. Before attacking, you may choose to gain green green. If you do, move all face down ball goers from your space to an adjacent space. That's actually kind of cool. That seems pretty good, yeah. Like I said, it tells a good story. All right. Go for it, Travis. Well, we're going to kick this guy out. Nice. And then, um, I guess I'm gonna attack one of these cultists. You can do that. Yeah. And I will just take my two sanity and accept that I've defeated him. Nice. I do have a free reroll, but. Whatever. Uh, 
And then because I'm in a space with one enemy. Mm -hmm. Let's go. And then I will rest for free. Nice. Cosmic fuel. Oh, that's not great. This is certainly gameplay, let me tell you. <laughs> Dancer of Azathoth, the nearest dancer moves three spaces toward me. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, fuck. He's super. What? How did he get from there? Uh, oh, sorry. Um, one, two, three. three. He should yeah. be here, yeah. And then spawn a dancer in blue. We love him. Drum and bass intensifies. I get one of these. The best part of the game. King Cobra. Hooded snake that produces a potent venom. I will take two stress to claim the King Cobra. I get green when attacking a monster or a cultist, and he takes one damage for me. One, one, two. It's still this one. I truly am the greatest escape artist ever, because not only am I swapping places with cultists, I'm also bringing my cook, my cobra, and my gorilla along oh, with me. Yeah, you have the whole show. You were performing at this. Yeah. All right. Uh, if you would like this King Cobra, that would be... You can have it. I don't, Perfect. I don't want to punch people. You can also probably have the sword game. All right. I'll move. You tackle this nerd? Oh, yeah. I'm going to move in here. I'm going to tackle this motherfucker. He's dead. <laughs> you think they make, like, a, like, like a, the noise, like, when you squeeze a bagpipe? Yeah. And all the air rushes it, out? It, or it's, like, uh, the, just, like, a, a fucking record skip. Just, <laughs> as they go, yeah. Uh, I'm going to move this guy up here. Save you, because you are Thanks. more movement-based, obviously. So you should be going up That's here to look for these actually guys. actually all that I do, it turns out. I mean, apparently it's all I do, too. <laughs> and then I'll do a trade action. Cool. Here's a snake and a sword and cane. I'm going to give this to you. Sure. What does the waitress do? Uh, I may move between spaces as if they were... Ga uh, as Gates as if they were adjacent. Okay. That's fine. So, so you had the sword cane and the king cobra? Yeah. That's kind of sick. All right. I'll draw a mythos card. Cosmic presence. Each cosmic enemy moves one space towards me. This is a fucked up room up here. All right, I do get one of these though. It's wife. My wife? Steve have wife? <laughs> she seems distraught or furious. The pistol she's carrying doesn't help. If you have a couple as a companion, discard them. You may take two stress to claim the wife or oh, the no. pistol. While you have her, gain one level in brawling. Hmm. Sick. Or when attacking, gain green. If you have the marksman skill, gain green, green. No, I definitely not marksman. I think I'm going to go for the brawl, because it's kind of the same thing, but she soaks for me. What does it say about having a couple? If you have the couple, discard them. She okay. shoots... Uh... Yeah, okay, the one is cheating. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Um. Okay, Uh. it is your turn. Those are my black dice. They are not yours. I don't know the fuck. <laughs> I don't know about that, man. <laughs> you know, this seems like a bad place. Oh, I'm the not... worst thing is cause we're not getting crazier because we're not making tests, so yeah. we're just like. I'm actually gonna go fight this cultist to like get some level, a stealth pass this guy. Oh yeah, that's right. You have stealth. Yeah, I do. Because you're a magician. Yeah, I'm gonna take my free. No, I'll punch him first. Yeah. That's great, actually. I'll take one. I'll take a little bit crazy. I run and may sneak three times. That's a lot more than three dudes. <laughs> <It's>, yeah. <sighs> I'm not getting the green dice really to use the arcane mastery. There's one on here. You could do the damage on your swap too. Yeah, that's kind of like that was my default one. But yeah. I, wanted, I was thinking whether one of the other two were better. I get you. I get you. Yeah, now I'll punch him again. Okay, he has one damage marked. Yeah. Oh, he's fucking dead. He is. I will happily take two more sanity damage. I will take my free rest as well. Nice. Mythos. The blind idiot god. Each cosmic enemy moves one space toward me. 
that sucks. Chill, brothers. Sun Occultist at yellow. All right, and you get attacked for two green and a black because they have the... He's cosmic. Cool. Not bad. I mean, oh. it's going to spawn another one, but that's not terrible. I think I'm going to spend the stress to reroll this then. Sure. So I can't use my... Okay, I'll take damage. <laughs> Alright. Can't use a swap for these two guys here. My turn. Yep. Do you want me to help you out? Eh. I don't know. I, I have, to, run kinda have anyway. to come down here. Right One, now. two, uh, let's go. Three, push this guy in here. He's dead because I can't kill the other one. Push him up the stairs, baby. Wow. Uh, second action. Yeah, check him out. They're clean. It's gonna be like the, that guy. <laughs> one of these. No. It's, it is this. That's why they're all here. They're all shaking hands. Like <laughs> I haven't seen you in forever. I was about to call him Steve, but that's my name. I'm gonna move. Oh my Steve. And I'm gonna push this guy off the balcony. Oh, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Just tackle him right off. Nuclear chaos. Nuclear. We just lost. I think. Fuck. Each cultist moves one space towards you. Oh, fuck. You'll just roll really good. Place a cosmic token on the nearest gate. You got toughness. You're okay. I do have toughness. All right. They're all going to attack me. They only attack for two greens. Yeah, you got toughness. All right. Be... Number one. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll do one oh, reroll. Oh, shit. All right, I will use a stress. Okay. First one down. Nice. I also have soak. Yeah, you got like guys that can die for you. You'll be yeah. It's not gonna be pretty, but you'll live. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, I'll do the reroll. I have a free reroll each time. Give me one more stress. I think we just have to let that go. Okay. All right, number three. My free reroll. Let's go. Nice. All right, I think we're Four. okay. Yeah. Free reroll. <laughs> Huge. Let's try again. Okay. Yeah. Steve's on death door. Well, not really. I have all these guys, but still. Yeah. Okay. Um, that, go for it. That was okay. That could have been worse. It wasn't good, but. Yep. I'm gonna punch the guy. That's here. The cultist. Oh yeah. Because I can maybe kill him. Yep. We're just begging for insanity. Huge. Just... Good job, Houdini. <laughs> uh, and then... Well, I think we need to help you out. So I'm gonna swap with one of these guys. Nice. And he'll take two and die. Huge. And then I'll punch another one. Hell yeah, Houdini. He's done. Because you have Arcane Mastery. Yeah. So I want to do something else? No, I was kind of hoping for some, like... Sanity? sanity. Yeah. No, no, we're actually the most sane people. Yeah, oh, I should just, like, heal all my stress from this when I sure. flipped it last time, but that was last time. All right, Mythos card. Yep, and then you get bonked, but spooked. Each investigator takes one stress for each animal companion they have. What happens if you don't have stress to take? You take wounds instead. Alright, King Cobra. Um, I'm actually going to kill the waitress. You don't, you don't lose a sanity for each ensorcelled condition you have as well, which should be zero. It is zero. And I'll start doing these guys' rules. One damage. Um, yeah, that's fine. And the other guy. We can take one. Nice. We got a gorilla. Yeah. All right, I'm going to start punching people. Hell yeah. So I got to roll my three, and then I can do... I am going to... Should I shoot the gun? I mean, I do get two green. I think I don't need to shoot the gun. Okay. Were you supposed to roll the dice if you didn't shoot the gun? Oh, I could add two more green. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Because I have a uh, green from the Cobra and... And Brawler, the, yeah, 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 okay. All right, so I'll take one Sanity, thankfully. 
Yay. I need to heal, so I think I'm going to move as opposed to trying to go more insane. Mm -hmm. We're going to move in here, knock this guy off, and then we're going to go one, two, three. Nice. Whew. Good as new. Steve is A-OK. -okay. You're fine. All right. Move each cultist and deep one enemy one space towards you. Oh, Lord, they coming. Then each cultist and deep one in a space line investigator kills a face down ball goer in their space. Okay. Is there a penalty for us killing these people? I don't think so. Yeah, discard it. It's probably just a balance to make Does it so that we can... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just so we can, like, solve it a bit easier. It's like, yeah. like take, doing actions for us. Sorry, this should be here. I do get one of these. It's oh, a yeah. champagne holder. The champagne is still cold. Someone has left to an unopened vial next to it. You may claim the champagne. Uh, you may discard this card to heal all your stress and discard all your ensorcelled cards. Or a vial of venom when attacking, you may discard this card to gain um, three green. I think I'm actually going to take the healing. That's pretty fair. Things were looking real spicy for a minute there. They were, but you know, Steve's tough. Steve's a tough guy. Yeah. Speaking of tough guy, Houdini, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm going to take my free rest action. I'm so jealous of that. <laughs> it's, really good. it's really fucking good. Oh, we haven't investigated these guys here, right? Fuck these fuckers. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna take a real S action. Nice. You could swap with this guy. Just pop him. Because I'm yeah. planning. I can push those guys like maybe down. I mean, not down this turn, but next turn. Yeah. Sure. Explodes. Cosmic appeal. All right, as of that's coming. Cosmic appeal. All right, as of that's coming. Crawling horror. The nearest hunting horror moves two spaces to you. Oh, fuck. Summon a deep one at red. Summon a hunting horror at blue. No, he that? wants to join the party. <laughs> that would be it. I guess. Attack for this nerd. Yeah. Three, Three black. Black. That's okay. I'm at blue. Yeah, you're tough. Well, actually, I'm tough. Not bad. One and one. Yeah, that's great. All right. It's Azathoth time. Honestly, the only thing I'd change is I'd take another Sandy if I could. Okay. <laughs> All right. When revealed, summon Azathoth into your space. Fuck. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hello, Houdini. I love your tricks. No. <laughs> uh, summon one dancer in your space. No. And place one cosmic token on every non-cosmic cultist. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Not on Azathoth, luckily. When he attacks, each also each Elder Sign also counts as an as a tentacle. That's pretty cool. That's kind of cool. It means that we can go sane, because I mean sane, because we're looking pretty good. Yeah. All right. I mean, I'm not right now, but like, this is a nightmare. All right. Uh, hey, do you have two sanity to do to flip these guys with your crystal ball? Yeah. Do you want to do that? Because then I can start pushing them. Too stress, you mean? Yeah, too stress. Yeah. It's them. They were just hanging out. All right. I'm going to move. I'm going to move. And then I'm like, I'm, I'm ushering them. You can usher two, right? Yeah. And they can do one at once. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Then we're going to go one, two, and I'm going to kick this guy up here and kill him. Well, actually, I'm going to tackle him down the stairs, because that just feels better. It makes more sense, too. It does. All right. My Mythos card is... The nearest Dancer of Azathoth moves three spaces towards you. Yay. Summon a Dancer Azathoth on blue. Let's no. get let's get out of here and never go back upstairs <laughs> again. No. All right. This guy's going to attack me for just two black... It's not bad. No, honestly, I feel as good as new. Yeah, dude, I would Inside love to go insane. Up. Please. Hell yeah. Uh, oh, shit. How do these guys flip? Um, when the Elder One advances. Okay, so we should be able to get them out of there before that happens. We just don't want to see an Ancient Evils. Because then these guys will come back under. Oh, yeah. I will punch the Hunting Horror. Hell yeah. With my fists. That's huge. I'll do three to him and take a sanity, right? 
Uh, yes. Let's go. I get a green die and upgrade something. I have to upgrade my escape artist. I can now use it in a space with any number of enemies. Let's look at that. That is actually huge. Yeah, uh, yeah. So for my second dash, I just. Uh, I send two damage to that guy. Yeah. And then I can rest. Two, three. For my free one. And then I'll like kick one of these guys. Down one, there. Two. Nice. Yeah. Right. Dancer oh. to Azathoth. Yeah, hungry still. Each cultist and dancer of Azathoth moves one space forward you. Hey! He's like, I know your tricks. And then summon a dancer at red. We have no dancers left to spawn. Great. This guy attacks me. Piece of shit. I want a fun card. <laughs> uh, two and a green. Two black and a green. Look at you. Yeah, you heal, like, free, so... Yep. All right. I can't heal the gorilla, can I? No. Oh, no. sorry, I was supposed to also trigger this. Um, I had an item and... Or I had two companions. So I would heal all of my stress. Nice. Yeah. All right, I'm going to move. I'm going to run. I'm taking this guy with me. Because I have things. All right, I'm going to move one, two. Hey, guys. Right, where, are you, where are you going? <laughs> this, is, this is overwhelming. No, you're fine. I'm going to push this guy and kill him. Good choice. You should usher that guy out of there this turn if you can. I don't think I can. I think I'll die. I'm going to have to run three times. I mean, Azathoth lands for three block. That's not terrible. I could probably survive. What is the... You'd think the Azathoth would hurt a little more than that. Oh, he's going to. He's going to. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, we're going to move again. Uh, I'm going to just basically end up where I am, but I'm going to kick this guy out too. Okay. Um, actually, I think... Yeah. No, I think we're actually going to kick out this guy. Him spawning another version of him is kind of scary. And I think the correct course of action is to usher this guy up here. And just assume I'm going to be okay. Yep. Okay. All right. Um, Mythos card. Cosmic Upheaval. Into, if there are three or more cosmic tokens available, place a cosmic token on each gate. Okay, that's kind of neat. Sure. Otherwise, he advances okay. completely. But he's going to. Uh, let's get attacked by the dancer first. Two black and green. Uh, I'll reroll this one. Actually, I'll reroll this one. Because I want the sanity damage. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Take a stress. Uh, I think we saved that for. Uh, oh. On theme. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to take this, This we're going to go like this. All right, traveling fugue, move to spaces two spaces away from your current space. Honestly, just take me like, like, fucking down here. It's nice and secluded. There's no other enemies to get ambushed by. It's really small, so Azathoth looks really funny in this room. That's fair. And then I get to upgrade one of these. Ooh. I think I gotta just assume I'm gonna survive and take the tackle. <laughs> okay. Reroll this one. Once again, I want the sanity. Uh oh. Mm. I think I'm still dead. I actually need both of them to go. All right, Steve's dead. Why oh no, I'm not dead. I, like yeah, I have guys. Let's kill the um, cobra. Yeah. Like, you gotta soak. Why did you get rid of your crystal ball? Did an item get rid of it? Uh, does it not discard? No, I don't think so. Unless I'm crazy. Huh. I thought I discarded, that's why I got rid of it. Yeah, it I doesn't do it, it doesn't do too much right now. I mean it is because these guys are gonna get flipped and shuffled. Alright. Oh, jeez. Azeroth goes fast. Yeah. It's getting tight. Um, so when it advances, move the nearest cosmic enemy one space towards me. He's there. And then we summon the guys up here. 
And then we place one of these on the farthest monster for me, which is going to be this Haunting Biaki. Horror. This Haunting Horror, yeah. Not Biaki, Justin is different. He's, he's mad at me, that's why he yeah. jumped off. He's also top heavy. He is very top heavy. All right, Travis, go for it. Okay. Um, Steve ain't dead yet. I'm going to use my free action here. Take two stress to flip these over. You did Piece it. Piece of shit. It's my first action. Punt this guy down the stairs. Nice. I'm going to take my free rest. Oh, you can get in there this turn, can't you? Yeah. Which is good, because then I can start putting damage on Azathoth. Yeah, if, if you're able to get in there, I can I can start fighting. Okay. Then, yeah, I move. And I can spend my... Yeah, my last action. One, two. All right, all these guys go. We did it. Good luck killing Azathoth. Thank you. I don't need it, to be honest. Crawling Horde. Nearest hunting a horde moves two spaces towards you. Deep one in red. Hunting horde in blue. Chill, brothers. <laughs> no. And I guess I get a fun encounter. Da, 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 da. The couple. Sergeant grabs the champagne, darling, but my wife was near the bucket. Uh, if I have the oh wife, my god, and the champagne was poisoned? <laughs> Let's if you go. Have a wife is a companion. Discard this card. Um, I can take the. I take the couple. If we could set up a trade, this might be good for you to take. And also, if the wife is dead. Sure. Sure. Yeah. If you have the champagne or the flask, you get to heal a stress at the end of each of your turns. Oh, that seems pretty sick. Yeah. <laughs> uh it's your turn justin all right i'm gonna move yeah i'm gonna bring the guys with me the boys including azathoth <laughs> including azathoth uh and Take. honestly i'm gonna just move them in like here sure and i'm gonna deal two damage to this guy and one damage to azathoth i'm gonna assume that you split it i think that's fair I think that's fair. Yeah, this guy's new, so there's nothing about him online. Especially since this one says, like, five total, or, like, yeah. three total, that implies that you can split it. Yes, I agree. Um, I'm going to rest twice. Just freshen up a bit, you know? Each call to send to me moves one location towards you. Honestly, that's a lot less scary than it was a few turns ago. Yeah. Place a cosmic token on the nearest gate... Oh, shit. It's going to be a super dude coming from there. All right, go for it. Oh, no, I got a fun encounter. Yeah. Monkey! <laughs> Highly trained, you think. You may take too stress to claim the monkey. You got to take the monkey, Justin. I am now stealthy as well. Sick. <laughs> I'm going to kill that guy. I'm actually, you know what? I might give it to you. If we do, if we do that trade. Yeah. Because. I think that's what I'm doing on my turn. But we want the wife dead, right? Well, I could take the wife i guess yeah what she do actually i don't think she cares about it now it's only when you draw it it says if you have the wife as a companion discard this card yeah but i think the only thing that matters right now is this i think that's only for when you draw okay. them yeah sure then i will uh let me check Swap places with Azathoth. That's fucking fuck. He two damage? Two damage. <laughs> Let's go. We only need to do that. Um. <laughs> don't worry. Don't, don't worry about it. I'll move here and I'll trade with you. Let's go. Yeah, it's only when you draw it you read the central text. Okay. I'm going to actually rest first and then I'm going to trade with you. I'm going to give you this cook and the couple. Nice. you want the monkey? Yeah, I Can would actually. Can stealth? Yeah, you, you don't seem to have much use for that. Sorry, so I have the cook. Oh, one free rest each turn. Yeah, that seems more useful for you. I'm keeping the gorilla, though. He's my yeah, he's yeah, yeah. my rest, my free rest. I am now feel so much better. Dancer of Azathoth. Nearest one moves three to me. Encounter. Spawn with blue. Oh, jeez, yeah, I think we might lose to time. That's okay. This guy's gonna attack me. 
for two hearts and green. Uh, just two hearts. It doesn't mean it's actually not cosmic. Oh, that's kind of weird. One and one. Yeah, that's fine. We can live with that. All right, Azathoth, I'm coming in. I'm gonna come bring in this guy. I'm just gonna push him and kill him. Nice. All right, Azathoth, you ready to fight? So I get one bonus. I'm going to choose to shoot my gun. I get one in brawling. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna rest before I go in with that free rest that I have. Okay. Two hits. Um, no, I get this as well. I get one free reroll. I think I'm happy to go crazy. I could grief you so hard with this escape artist. <laughs> <laughs> uh, three damage. Especially with the low three. Let's go again. Do I swap with one of these and swap with you? <laughs> no! <laughs> Good luck, Steve. I was the traitor all along. That's a lot of sanity damage. Holy shit. Uh, it's only when they attack. Oh, when he's attacking. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I was like, my god. I think you can deal two damage to him. Uh, yes. I, yes. I lost one sanity that in those two attacks. It's kind of bullshit. All right, uh, this one. Fuck. Uh, each cultist and dancer of Azathoth moves one location towards you. Here comes the party, baby. Yeah, well, they know he's down there. Yeah. Who was this on? Uh, I think that was on the... Was it, it was on the dancer that came down, probably. On, maybe. It might have been on the hunter. You know what? I actually think it was on the hunter. Because the hunter who... fell off because he was unbalanced. Yep. Come on in, guys. Summon a dancer of Azathoth on red. What the fuck's he doing up there? Yeah, that's not where you belong. All right. When this guy advances, move the cosmic, nearest cosmic any one space towards me. Uh, it'll be this guy. This guy's two away. Oh, he's two away. Yeah, send him in. Um, and then we summon a cultist up here, and then this guy becomes bigger. Okay. And then you get bonked by Azzy. Yeah, we get three more of these. I don't... Yeah, we're probably not going to win. But that's okay. Because, I mean, our, our, look at our two characters. They're like... They were so slow in how they did things. Yeah. But... Yeah, we're real slow to get going. Yeah. But we got to play with Steve, so that's a win, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. This guy's fun. Yeah, I mean, I like both these guys. All right, uh, go for it. You get attacked by Azzy. It's <laughs> a high real lose. Come on. Uh, two wounds and a sanity. Cool. Uh, I swap. Those are my dice. Yeah, I swap with Azathoth. Let's go two damage. Yeah. Let's not take him over. No, no. I need one more. <laughs> Can you swap multiple times or once per? I don't know. It doesn't say I can't. It says, is, is there a limit to special actions? I couldn't find anything about special actions okay, in here. Okay, then probably not. I'm going to play it like I can do as much as I want. Yep. Wow. Yeah, I'll fucking swap with that off again, idiot. Flip them. So, actually, some abilities can be used as a special action. They can only be used during this phase of the turn, and players must spend one of their actions to use it. Okay. All right, stage three. When revealed, move him to the red gate. Uh, at each gate, summon a cultist for each cosmic token there. Hello. Then, place one cosmic token on every non-cosmic cultist monster on the board, starting with the ones nearest to Azathoth. Jesus Christ. As long advances on the track, if there's two or more in the discard pile. Oh, okay, sure, yeah. Yeah, sure, man. Yeah, fuck, fuck me, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Um, I have one action left. You can do three spaces? Yeah. So sick. One to three spaces away. Incredible. And then you can get to him this turn. You can get there anyway, wait a minute. Is that better? This gives, this gives these guys a health. Is 
since you have to move to get to him anyway, <laughs> I think I would rather swap with this guy. Sure. And that's one less guy that you have to slog through to get up here. Hell yeah. I'll get attacked by Azathoth. That's not really a problem for this team. Yeah, I'm not concerned. Here's your Mythos card. Thanks. Nuclear Chaos. Each cultist moves one space toward you. Put a cosmic token on the nearest gate. There's none left. Okay, good. Some of the cultists, some blue. Whatever, man. Yep. <laughs> and then uh, it's fight me time. Azathoth is three black and two green. That's fine. Can I, can I choose the other guy first? Yep. I'd, yeah, I'd love to do that. Uh, black, first. green. It's fine. We'll take our one damage. Yeah, and then uh, as he's. Three black, two green. It's not terrible. Two damage and a horror. Yeah, I'm gonna take a stress and see if I can get some different on these. Take a stress, see if I can get something different on one of these. <laughs> Let's go! One damage, one horror. Yeah. I was kind of thinking, wondering if I wanted to try and get another corruption out of that. Another... Yeah, I mean, you could have tried to roll this because those has doesn't have um has the elder sign, which is like horror here too. Yeah, it's like it's kind of the same, isn't it? It's slightly worse odds. I have fifty percent on these, mm -hmm. so yeah. All right, my turn. Yeah. Uh, come on, guys. Fuck, <laughs> <laughs> there's so many dudes in my way. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what are you going to do? One, it... two. <laughs> when you're I'm, a hammer, Justin. I'm going to put everything's a nail. All you can do is nail these guys. Uh, I'm going to push this one and then this guy out. And you still feed it to Azathoth. I agree. That's why I'm here. Uh, so I get a roll four. One free reroll. Uh, four damage on Azathoth. That's pretty good. Let's go again. It's not so good. Not so good. I would like to take some sanity. Let's go. Two damage. Two. All right. I go insane. So I'm going to move. That's me. Two spaces. Fuck. <laughs> That's kind of huge for me. Alright, and I'm going to... He's got a fourth stage, are you fucking kidding me? Do I that. Guess they all do. Yeah. If there are more... Oh! oh. That's not great. He's going to advance because uh, there's no cosmic tokens available. Okay, we lose them. We lose them. Nice. Good job, Azathoth. Well, yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I, I feel like... played a pretty good game. I think we did, too. Uh, I, I mean, I think we just weren't prepared for the speed of Azathoth compared to... Yeah. Uh, ...to Thugga, right? To Thugwa. Mm -hmm. And you can't win them all. You can't. No. One game wouldn't be fun if you could. Exactly. Uh, well, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this. We'll definitely do this again. Mm -hmm. Um... Uh, and I'd love to get Brynn involved, because I think yeah, he would also have a good fun. time with it. Mm -hmm. uh, have a good one, everybody. Bye!